let's play a game and in this game you are a detective i'm going to give you a few clues and you're going to solve the puzzle so let's get started here's what we know we know that there are two sets a and b the number of elements of set a is 3 and the number of elements of set b is 2 so a has 3 elements and b has 2 elements and we know a little bit about their cartesian product as well so a times b is this we know its first element second element third element but a lot of its elements are missing okay so here's what you know about a and b and a times b and you need to find the sets a and b try this challenge yourself okay so let's do this together one thing that will be useful for us is remembering that the cartesian product contains ordered pairs x comma 1 y comma 2 and z comma 1 they're all ordered pairs what does that mean that means that their first element is coming from the set a and their second elements are coming from the set b so x y z and 1 2 3 they are coming from sets a and sets b can we now solve this puzzle okay let's see a will have x y and z that's going to be our set a and because we know that a has three elements this matches what we see here x y and z these are the three elements what about set b set b has elements 1 and 2 b has 1 and 2 and because b has two elements this solves our mystery this completes the puzzle let's try one more we have a cartesian product of a with itself so a times a but we don't know what that is all we know is the number of elements of a times a is 9 what else do we know well we know that two of them are minus 1 and comma 0 and 0 comma 1 knowing just these two facts can we figure out what a is we need to find the set a go ahead try this on your own okay so let's solve this together same approach the cartesian product contains ordered pairs let's look at these two minus 1 0 and 0 comma 1 okay the first elements should come from the first set and the second elements should come from the second set but here we have both the sets as a this cartesian product has both the sets as a so the first thing that we can note here is minus 1 and 0 they definitely belong to a so a definitely has minus 1 and 0 similarly we can say that 0 and 1 also belong to a this tells us a lot about a so so far we have three elements of a minus 1 0 and 1 can we find more do we need to find more let's look at the first clue the first clue was a times a the cartesian product has nine elements that's going to be 3 times 3 which means a has only three elements and these are its three elements minus 1 0 and 1 so a has three elements they are 0 1 and minus 1 which means we have actually solved the puzzle with just these two clues we figured out what a is so the set a is minus 1 0 and 